sir i want to ask you this one kind of personal question please do uh personally for me <laughs> on a personal level yeah. a lot of the things i do in my career that little extra push i give in my yeah. own work is for my mother sure is there a similar emotion for you in this film for this film it's for me everything this whole film i did for my mother because when she died in 2007 and she couldn't go back to kashmir she told me ke ho sake the beta film banai so in 2008 i started writing this is this, i wouldn't have made this film if she wasn't wasn't my mother yeah so it is really made for her so what is what has she spoken to you about the incidents everything because i was grown up i i, I know everything everything she said is in the film okay everything she experiences in the film actually her name is shanti devi and the character in the film sadia who plays is called shanti mm. so the film is really uh, in a way her life and what we all went through so, i mean think about it just think about it where do you stay dadar to imagine kar in dadar you wake up tomorrow and outside your house there is a little thing saying ranveer get out of dadar in one month or you'll be shot dead how will you react and then your neighbors are shot and then they say everybody by the name whatever what is your full name alabadia alabadia would be shot dead and you have to leave dadar within one month yes. and you cannot go back to dadar for 30 years it's 30 they haven't yet gone back yeah ab ye to young log sun rahe hain na politicians sun le पार्लियामेंट में सुन लें तुम्हारा ये पॉडकास्ट तो उन तक आवाज में थर्टी ईयर्स कैन यू इमेजिन यू कांट गो बैक टू दादर इट्स क्रेजी सो इफ आई गेव इलेवन ईयर्स ऑफ माई लाइफ आई गेव इट बिकॉज आई रियली थिंक दिस स्टोरी नीड्स टू बी टोल्ड कैन यू एक्सप्लेन दिस डीपर like why did it actually take 11 years but because see when you when you become passionately involved with something see there is another important thing this is also true for your show let me and this is true for that monetization thing you said ingmar bergman if you know is a swedish filmmaker is a grand master in cinema he had the principles he said uh, commandments of cinema and there are 10 i'll tell you the first three which this office believes in number one commandment when you make a film is do shall entertain that's the most important thing if this show you're doing with me is boring nobody's going to see it <laughs> yes bottom line yes so if i make shikara and it's a boring film nobody's paying 200 bucks to see it you have to entertain number one because people are paying money if these young people go to see my film on friday i hope they're going to buy tickets no yes sir 200 300 400 if i if it's a boring film why should they pay yeah. they shouldn't so number 1 commandment do shall entertain the second commandment which is critical do shall entertain without selling your soul make your show don't sell your soul make your cinema don't sell your soul be yourself be yourself be honest to yourself mm. and the third commandment of course is make every film as if it's your last <laughs> and and it can be i mean i'm 67 maybe the film releases this friday i pop it on on sunday mm. i can mm. but i'm not saying i will i <laughs> hope i don't but you know so this is like so when you do something as if it's your last think you think when you edit the show with me you think that this is the last show of uh, your whatever you're doing you will kill for it man yes 